don't know my name is Carrie make sure to subscribe turn on post notifications and give me a thumbs up if you haven't done so right so what I'm gonna be doing is basically trying out two of the NYX professional makeup foundations and just seeing the differences between the two now I've already been wearing the total drop foundation from NYX all the time and people always ask me what are you wearing people can't even believe that I'm wearing it because it's so light and then this one is the new one that they just came out with Alyssa actually collabed with them and came up with this one so that's the newest one they have out um, I like both but I just want to show you guys the differences between the two and which one is better at which basically so I'm just gonna wipe this makeup off so I can have a clean canvas probably not my whole face probably just the bottom because I don't really need to do my whole face <laughs> to show you guys the difference between the two. So let me get this off and then we're gonna jump into that. So I cleared up half of each side, right? Let me take my earrings off just so I can have a better little canvas for you. So I'm gonna use the next Professional Makeup Angel Veil Skin Perfecting Primer and I'm just gonna do the same thing to both sides. Girl, I think I OD'd, but <laughs> it's all good. So I got it all primed up. So it's basically ready. I'm gonna apply the foundations to both sides. So I'm going to be putting the Can't Stop, Won't Stop, Next Professional Makeup. And this is supposed to be full coverage foundation. I'm gonna put it on this side of my face. And then I'm going to use the NYX Professional Makeup Total Control Drop Foundation on this side of my face. So it's gonna be just like this, girl. So let's just go ahead and see what happens. Um, I'll do the control total. No, hmm, I'll do the total control first, okay? So, I'm gonna have this way over here. That should be enough, right? <laughs> Probably more than enough. So I'm gonna use my makeup sponge, which I also got from NYX Professional Makeup, and I'm just gonna blend this in on this side. For anyone who's wondering, the color I'm using is 17.5. Okay, so that's basically how that looks. And just so we can, you get a little bit of coverage here. You still see a little bit of flaws, like the dark marks and stuff, but it's not too bad at all. But what I like about it is that it is buildable, well for me at least, so I'm just gonna add another layer and we're gonna see how that goes. So that is the second layer. And as you can see, it does really well with coverage. Now, me personally, I don't have, I have pigmentation issues here, but it's not so crazy that I need to do um, dark spot correcting and color correction all that. I don't care to do that. It's just way too much work for me. So I just use foundation and I pile it on until I get the look that I want. So this is normally what I would do um, if I was using this foundation. What I will say is it's very, very light. You can barely feel it, feel it. You can barely feel it. Um, it may have some oil in it. I don't know if it's oil based or not, but it's very moisturizing. It's not really dry or matte at all. Um, so if you have oily skin, that's something to keep in mind. You can still wear it. You just need to set it properly so that way you're not greasing all up. And um, that's that for this foundation. So let's move on to the Can't Stop, Won't Stop. The color I'm using in this one is Cappuccino. Typically, I do mix Cappuccino with um, Deep Staple because it gives me the perfect color. But I'm not doing this for a look to actually wear, so I'm not gonna go ahead and mix it. I'm just gonna use one of them just so we can get an understanding, okay? <laughs> so. I just put one pump of that stuff and I'm gonna go ahead and blend that out. Okay, so so far this is 
one coat of the Can't Stop Won't Stop. And you can see that basically with one coat, it's covering the same amount as the total drop foundation and the total foundation is two layers. So this is just one layer. So I'm gonna go ahead and do a second layer so we can get a look at that. So that's the second layer of the can't stop won't stop now it's not hard to see that obviously is very full coverage now it covers basically everything you have so this is buildable they're both buildable foundations but of course um of course the can't stop won't stop is going to cover more because it's a full coverage foundation now me personally hmm The total drop, okay, so this, <coughs> this total control foundation is the foundation that I'm going to continue to wear for like an everyday look. It's very, very light and airy, so you can feel your skin, you can feel your pores. It doesn't really feel like you have on anything at all, so that's what I love about it. And you can just put it on and go. Now, the can't stop, won't stop is what I would wear if I want to be extra flawless because it just gives you that full on glam, I'm done up, honey, look at my skin, it's flawless look. Like, it covers everything. So this stuff is amazing. What I will say about this is it has a matte finish to it. So once it dries, it'll actually be very matte, which is also good because that helps in a flawless look. But if you're not a matte person, um, you can still wear it. I would say use like a dewy setting spray. You know how to jazz it up to make it look your way, okay? But um, they're both really amazing. This is gonna be my everyday and this is when I wanna step it up a notch. So this stuff is amazing. You don't need much at all to get like a really good coverage because the first layer will give you decent coverage but the second layer will give you all out full coverage, okay? So I just wanted to share this video with you guys because I know that some people have been asking, what are you wearing, what are you wearing? It's been this, darling, it's been this. But um, this is really good for someone who doesn't have a lot of marks and markings on their face, then you could go ahead and rock this. Um, if you do have a lot of markings and stuff on your face, you would have to probably do some color correcting or maybe layer this on. But if you just wanna make it easier on yourself and you have a lot of markings and stuff that you wanna cover up, the Can't Stop and Won't Stop foundation is definitely for you, girl, because it will cover all those flaws right on up. So. With that being said, <laughs> it's not a battle of the two foundations. It's just preference and which one will work for certain people, which one you want to wear, when and why. I'm probably rambling way too much, but now I'm trying to get a look. Hold on. Yeah. So yeah, that's a quick, quick video for you guys. That's really quick. I just wanted to share that with you guys really quick. Um make sure you are subscribed to my channel i know you guys probably did not enter the giveaway if you did not enter the giveaway go ahead and do that i'll put it somewhere up here also in the description box so you guys can click on that and win some free makeup who doesn't want free makeup anyways i'm out of here you guys love you bye